All right, and welcome back. I am giving this a try with the heaviest mech I can take in because I had such a horrible time on this mission. Um, I don't know what it is about it. it. Just there was so much thrown at me, and it just wore me down. I think it was specifically there were tanks that had auto cannons, and it was the auto cannons that kept messing me up. But we shall see how it works. Wish me luck. Ambient temperature, 69.56 degrees. Local this time, isn't the mech I picked. 34, 55 GMT. All right, well. All systems nominal. This is what I got, this is what I got. First we'll do the boring thing of sniping this guy. Because I really am in no hurry to charge in. Yeah, I remember how tedious this was, but I, if this is an option presented to me, I'm going to take it. I can't play. I'm just going to adjust my aim. I'm moving it a little closer. Alright. Yeah, it's hard to really nail the accuracy from this far away. There we go. Yeah, I think all that screaming you hear... ...is the tanks that have missile locks on me. So let's see if I can't just blast them. for a wolf and uh, I basically had it in the bag and then there was a message that overrode the shutdown warning message so I didn't know I was about to shut down and then I just did and defeat was snatched from the jaws of victory I was pissed alright I'm gonna focus on the Hellbringer Almost got. 
got him. There we go. Alright, this is going a little bit easier. I always have problems with the heat on this. I think this is the mad dog. Nav, Sigma, reached. Come on, a little bit more, a little bit more. Let's get turned in the right direction, because bad things happen once I get around. Come on. Ugh, oh, heat. See, now it's just tedious. Alright, let's book it. Still got that guy's cockpit. Where's my dust-off zone? Nav Tau. It says take out targets of opportunity. I don't even know where they might be. Probably a tent hiding somewhere around here. I think I've found a target of opportunity twice? Something like that. And then these are the tanks. That always cause me problems when I actually go to leave. Or I can circumvent them. get lost in a canyon and killed by the explosion, but just to be different. Let's go this way. Satellite link established. I don't know, there might be something. You know, maybe there's a target of opportunity off this way. Satellite link established. I can't zoom out any further. Just gotta get away from the big explosion. It'll tell me when I hit the minimum safe distance. Soon, I hope. Minimum safe distance reached. Perfect. All right. Wow, they've already got a lock on me. All right, I'm gonna have to try to hit them with my large lasers. I probably shouldn't have used. Warning. Temperature spike detected. Yeah. Bring more shots. Right, you know what? I'm gonna stop here because I get blinded. They're using up ammo. There it is. See, I don't want that in the middle of a fight. Alright, let's do this. Target of opportunity. I don't even know where they might be, but survived. Those tanks always. I don't know what combination of weapons they have, but suddenly I'm missing an arm half the time I find them. And it's hard for me to, like, strafe around them just because they're always right around the corner. But a win is a win. I'm not gonna argue. Those turrets of opportunity. I don't know, man. I'm not convinced they exist on every mission that it says they do. I think it might be a red herring. Oh boy. That was intense. This, this mission, it took me like five tries the first time I played it. I did everything I could think of and nothing worked. Nav, Tau. Reached. Mission. Successful. Alright. Well, no targets of opportunity, but I think I am still ahead of my honor for my last playthrough. Could be wrong, but maybe. My hit percentage is definitely getting better. Well, that's it for this episode.